Hey guys, Rana here and in this exciting video, I'm gonna show you how you can sell your digital downloads on htc.com. But before that, if you are new to this channel, consider subscribing and don't forget to press that bell icon alongside that subscribe button so that you won't miss my new uploads. First, I'll show you how much money people are making with their digital downloads by selling on htc.com. Next, I'll show you how you can create your own digital downloads Next, I'll show you how you can list that product on Etsy.com so that you can make money. The great thing about Etsy, it organically pushes your product to sale. You don't need to be a SEO expert and of course, you don't need to be a graphic designer as well. I'll show you how to create digital downloads just by dragging and dropping. So without wasting more time, I'm going to share my computer screen. I'm going to show you how to create and sell digital downloads on Etsy.com. So let's get started. Okay, so I've opened one of the listing on Etsy.com and this is a great example what you can do with your digital downloads when you sell it on Etsy.com. So this person made this much sale with this product and you can see this cost only 302 Indian rupees guys. I'm from India that's why it's Indian rupees. If you live in different country currency will be different. And let's quickly calculate how much money this person made with his digital downloads and later I'll show you how you can create your digital downloads and how you're gonna sell it on irsi.com. But first let's calculate his earning with his digital downloads. This person got 4714 sale. Multiply the price of the product 302 rupees. This is 14,23,628 rupees guys. If you convert into dollars, let me show you how much dollar this person made with his digital downloads. If we convert Indian rupees to dollars, here you can see $17,848 this person made with his digital downloads. Awesome right? This is a phenomenal earning guys you can make with your digital downloads. There are many people who are making tons of money with their digital downloads. If you want to become one of them, all you have to do is just watch this video till the end because this is not going to be longer video. This is going to be a shorter video. Don't skip any single part of this video. Anyways, let's move on. Now I'm going to show you guys how you're going to create this kind of digital products so that you can sell it on your HC store. Okay, so now you have to come to this website canva.com here you can create your digital download for free or you can buy a pro plan of Canva if you need more features of canva.com. Go down the description box of this video and open canva.com and start creating your digital download. On canva.com here come to the search bar and search for quotes and open quotes. So guys here you can see we have different types of quotes templates that you can use right away. So let me quickly select one of them. So I like this one. I'm going to click on it. Okay. So this is the editing section of canva.com. In the middle of the screen you can see we have the canvas where you can edit this template or you can download this template right away just by clicking on the download button. But neither I'm going to do it nor I recommend you to do so. Because I want you to design your template with your creativity so that your template exists only in your Etsy store. So always keep in mind that never copy someone else's design. So this is the one step to success when it comes to selling digital products on Etsy. Anyways, let's look at the left side. This is the pre-designed templates that you can use. If you still don't like this template, you can still have option to import different types of template from here. If you look at this section and this is another elements that you can use. You can add elements, you can upload a file, text, photos, so and so forth. There are tons of different ways that you can use to design your template. And good thing about the canva.com, you don't need to be a designer to create your digital downloads. Let me show you how. So as you know, we are going to create a quotes. First of all, I'm going to remove the background color. I'm going to select the color, right click and select delete. And this way, I just remove the background color. Next, I'm going to remove this text, select that, click delete and that text will be deleted. Great. Next, I'm going to change the font. Select the font. Go to this drop down menu and select the font that you like. Okay, so I like this font. Next, I'm going to hover my mouse over here. I'm going to make it center. Next, we have the font size. Here you can increase or decrease the size of your font as you can see. Next, we have the text color. You can change your text color if you want. 
by clicking over here and from here you can change your text color i'm going to keep it as it is next you can make it bold if you want select the font click on bold the font will be bold and you can literally change anything with your font with your design i'm happy with my design over here if you are not you can go to the elements and from here you can add different types of element you can add still pictures so and so forth or even you can upload your own image over here whatever text whatever design you like you can just grab that text over here and add into your template i'm not gonna do it i'm gonna click delete so i'm happy with my template next let's download this template to do so let's click over here and then click on download and i'm gonna download this template with transparent background so i'm gonna check this box and click on download all right so your template is ready to sell on etsy.com but before we list this template on etsy we are going to test this template on somewhere else so that your customer won't face any problem when they download this template so this is a placeit.net so here you can test your templates before sell it on etsy.com let me show you how first let's have your mouse over mockups go to print on demand and then click on t-shirts if you are creating digital downloads for wall arts you can go to wall arts right now i've created this template for t-shirt i'm going to click on t-shirts so guys here we're going to upload this template first of all select any model i'm going to select this model next come over here and upload your image click on that and then click on upload from your device let's select your template and click open and i'm going to scale this up right side you can see the preview okay you can adjust this template if you want great so i'm happy with the editing let's click on crop so here you can see guys the template look exactly like this on the t-shirts if you scroll down you can see different looks of the template okay so once you're happy with the look of your template now you are ready to sell on etsy but before that you can download these images from placeit.net so that you can upload these images on etsy.com when you list your digital download your customer can see how this digital download will look on t-shirt when they print on it okay so this is another great way to sell the digital downloads on etsy.com so now let's list this digital download on etsy let's move to the next part all right guys first of all go to the description box of this video and open etsy.com and from here you have to create an account to do it let's click over here sign in and then click on register fill the simple sign up form and then click on register once you register on etsy come over here your account and then click on sell it on etsy and now click on get started click on let's do this you can skip this questionnaire now scroll down click on skip this questionnaire now click on start your shop select your shop language i'm going to select english shop country india shop currency indian rupees good let's click on save and continue enter your shop name and then click on save and continue all right guys in the next step we are going to list a product that we just download first of all we have the photos of the product click on add a photo and upload the photo of your product so this is the product select that click open so remember this the size of the product should be at least 2000 this is a lesser than 2000 so that's why we are getting this error message so here add at least seven images guys so remember to upload mock-up images as well so this is a tutorial video i'm not gonna do it i'm not gonna waste your time you can adjust your thumbnail if you want so i'm happy with this thumbnail scroll down if you have a video of your product you can add over here so we don't have a video let's add the title of this product next about this listing who made it i did it what is it this is a finished product when did you make it i make it recently in 2022 select the category i'm gonna select it digital print you can see we have the primary color secondary color height width of the product and these are the optional things you can add these things if you want otherwise you can leave it as it is scroll down now select the type this is a digital download product okay this is very important guys renewal options automatically 
okay scroll down here you have to type the description of the product so i'm going to quickly type over here all right so i've added the description scroll down so next we have production partner you can add your production partner over here next we have these sections you can add the section you can add tags thus you can say quotes click on add quote add motivational quotes something like that material is optional scroll down here you have to set the price i'm gonna set it 200 indian rupees quantity one sq number if you have one you can add i'm gonna leave it as it is next we have the personalization i'm gonna turn it off and finally you have to upload a digital download file click on upload file select the file click open great and finally click on save and continue all right guys so you have successfully upload a listing on this website you can add more listing by clicking on add more listing button but right now let's go to the next part how you will get paid click on that so guys here you can add your payment method i'm gonna add paypal click on add paypal so here you have to type your paypal email and confirm typing your paypal email and then click on save once you do it click on save and continue now you have to confirm your email let's go to your mailbox okay we got the email from etsy let's open it now click on confirm account all right guys perfect you have confirmed your email address and your etsy account is all set you can click over here to sign in let's come back to this page and refresh it so guys here you have to add your billing information like you have to add your credit card and billing address so i'm going to quickly add my billing information over here all right once you fill this information click on save and continue now select this option now go to this drop down menu for security purpose let's select phone for the authentication method so now so guys here you have to select the so guys here you have to keep your shop safe by authentic all right so now you have to add the two factor authentication on your etsy store let's go to this drop down menu here you can authenticate your store with the text message phone call or the authentication app but more secure way to authenticate your etsy store is by selecting the authentication app if you want to know how to use the authentication app to authenticate any kind of website just watch this video you will find the video link in the description box as well but right now i'm going to use the text message click continue add your phone number first select your country code and i'm going to type my phone number over here and i'm going to click on send code so i'll receive the code and i'm going to enter the code over here and then click on continue you can save your bookmark codes into your computer just by clicking on save to computer button or you can copy these code and paste it on your notepad once you do it click on open your shop so once you do it your shop will be ready and you're ready to sell your digital downloads so if you're seeing this message that means your digital product is under review and will be live on your c store once it approved anyways that's the end of this video i hope you enjoy the video if you learned something from today's video don't forget to hit the like button and don't forget to subscribe to this channel for more videos just like this one and don't forget to check out these two videos guys. That being said, goodbye. Till then, I'll see you next time.